going to study about amplitude. So we have already shown that how we can represent the motion of an air molecule. Suppose say this is an air molecule and this air molecule is vibrating. When this air molecule is vibrating, we can change that vibration into graphical representation as like this where we are plotting some displacement and time. So we can obtain a graphical representation like this and it was previously shown. So when this air molecule is vibrating, it will have a maximum displacement towards this upward direction and it will have a maximum displacement towards this downward direction. Say that this maximum displacement is 2 meter. Then obviously it will be same towards the downward motion to 2 meter. So this maximum displacement of this air molecule from the mean position is called as this amplitude. So here the amplitude is 2 meter. And suppose say that initially the stopwatch at 5 0 seconds and after 5 seconds it reaches a 2 meter height. So when we are looking at the graph at 5 seconds the height will be 2 meter. At 5 seconds the height will be 2 meter. So we can represent this height as the amplitude. This is how we are obtaining the amplitude from the graph and this is the physical meaning of 